One of the things that's important to consider when starting to do some knee strengthening exercises is good biomechanics and movement patterns. Oftentimes we'll see people trying to do some exercises and they've done them incorrectly and instead of helping themselves, they make things worse. So before doing the exercises, think of rhythm mechanics. And here's what we want you to think about. From a squat or a seated position, just make sure that we don't allow the knees to go in front of our toes. And holding uh, a broom handle or a stick here will allow us to make sure that we're doing the proper squat. So if I were to sit and my knees went in front or hit this bar, that would be an uh, incorrect squat. And oftentimes we'll see people sit like that. We want to make sure again that we engage the ankle, the knees, and the hips in a proper manner to where the knees never exceed the front of our toes. This reduces the stress on the front uh, muscles, which uh, aggravate the knee and allows us to use the posterior muscles, which kind of help stabilize that knee. So good exercise is going to be down and up, down and up. You can always modify your depth by making sure that if you have something here and just let your behind touch it, then we're going to go down and up. So if you're a geriatric patient or somebody who uh, is having significant pain, this would be a good starting point, again, making sure that we're using good technique. For uh, an athlete that is going to be doing squats or lunges improperly, going against the wall and going to a full squat down and up, we'll make sure that, again, the knees do not get in front of the toes and our head isn't getting forward and we're using the muscles that help stabilize the knee correctly. So a wall squat like this or a seated squat with the staff are two good ways of making sure that you're recruiting the right muscles, particularly as you start to advance into some of the other exercises that we're going to show you for strengthening. And if you have any questions, give us a call. We'd be happy to evaluate your need and get you on a specific uh, protocol for your ailment.